1001 Solve Problems in Engineering Mathematics, Day 3, number 127 to 130. So this is all about logarithm. Okay, so let's start with number 127. Given logarithm of 7 to the base 4 equals n, find logarithm of 1 over 7 to the base 4. Okay, so to answer this, gagamitin natin. So recall muna natin yung mga properties natin. So ayan yung mga logarithmic uh, properties natin. Okay, so ang given natin ay, sulat lang ulit natin, medyo malabo kasi. So we have logarithm of 7 to the base 4 equals n. So ang hinahanap natin ay logarithm of logarithm of 1 over 7 base 4. Okay, so ang gagamitin natin dito ay itong quotient. Okay, so quotient rule ang gagamitin natin kasi we have, yung argument natin is 1 over 7. So pwedeng i-express ito, ang numerator daw ay logarithm of x, ayan, base a, yung denominator ay magiging negative. So pwede nating isulat ito as logarithm of numerator minus logarithm of the denominator parehas na base 4. Okay, so this equal to logarithm of 1 base 4 minus logarithm of 7 base 4. And then logarithm of 1 kahit anong base, kahit anong base ang logarithm ng 1 ay equal sa 0. Okay? So bakit logarithm of 1 kahit anong base ay 0? Kasi we have logarithm, pag mer time logarithm of x, base a equals y. Ang katumbas nito sa exponential ay itong base, we have a to the eto a to the y equals dun sa argument natin a to the y equals x so parehas ng ibig sabihin niyan ito yung logarithmic form ito naman yung exponential form so kung meron tayong logarithm of uh, 1 so if we have logarithm of 1 base kahit anong base ito eh so kahit anong base lagay natin a ang magiging value nito ay 0 kasi kapag tin-transform natin sa exponential form so we have a to the 0 is equal to 1. So any number raised to 0, except 0 yung A, any number raised to 0 is equal to 1. So that is why logarithm of 1 kahit anong base ay equal sa 0. So we have 0 minus logarithm of 4 base 7. And then from the given, logarithm of 7 base 4 is equal to N. Since meron tayong negative dito, so therefore we have, so wala na tong 0, negative logarithm of 7 base 4. So therefore, we have negative n. So the correct answer is letter D, negative n. Okay, so next number, number 128. Logarithm of 10 base a, so medyo malabo, if logarithm of 10 base a equals 0.25, what is the value of logarithm of a base 10? Okay, so... Sulat lang muna natin. So we have logarithm of 10 base A equals 0.25. So isulat natin ito sa exponential form. Okay? So exponential form neto, we have yung base natin, A raised to, ito yung, ito yung exponent natin, 0.25 equals, ito yung argument, equals dun sa argument 10. Okay? So, pwede na natin masolve ang A dito. So, in 0.25, pwede natin niyang isulat as fraction para mas madaling isolve. 0.25, so that is the same as 25 over 100 or lowest term natin, that is equal to 1 fourth. So, A raised to 1 fourth is equal to 10. So, we can uh, easily solve for A by raising both sides of the equation by 4. Okay? So, para pag dinistribute natin 1 fourth, times 4, so that is equal to 1, or simply A na lang. So therefore, A is equal to 10 to the ten to the fourth power. So pwedeng isulat ito as 100 or 10,000. 10 to the fourth is 10,000. So ngayon, hinahanap natin ay, what is the value of log A to the base 10? So substitute lang natin. So we have log A to the base 10. Ang value ng A natin is 10 to the fourth. So we have logarithm of 10 to the fourth base 10. And then, apply natin yung property. Kapag may exponent daw tayo, yung exponent pumupunta lang dito. Okay? So, pumupunta lang dyan. So, we have 4 
logarithm of 10 base 10. So itong 10 pwede nang hindi isulat itong base 10 eh. So logarithm of 10 na lang yan. And we know that logarithm of 10 is equal to 1. So tandaan kapag ang base kapag ang yung argument ay same sa base equal lang yon sa 1 palagi. So applicable yan kahit anong base natin. So log 10 that is equal to 1. So therefore the correct answer is 4 na lang. Okay? So letter B 4. Okay, so next number, number 129. Given logarithm of y base b equals 2x plus logarithm of x base b. Which of the following is true? Okay, so rewrite lang muna natin. So we have logarithm of y base b equals 2x plus logarithm of x base b. So, unang gagawin natin dito, dalawa yung may logarithm pag samahin natin sa isang sign. So, transpose this to the other side or we can subtract logarithm of x base b. So, we have logarithm of y base b. So, lumipat sa kabila ito, magiging negative logarithm of x base b equals 2x. Since our base are both b, so pwede natin i-apply yung uh, property ng logarithm, yung quotient. Kapag minus, mapapapunta sa denominator. So this will be equal to logarithm, base B. So yung numerator natin ay Y over, so itong negative, mapapapunta siya sa denominator. Okay, so pwede natin lagyan ng parenthesis yan. Equals 2X. Then, isulat natin sa exponential form neto. So anong exponential form neto, yung base natin, so yun yung magiging base pa rin sa exponential form. And then ang exponent natin ay itong 2X. And that is equal to argument ng logarithm. Okay? So we have y over x. And solve for y. So multiply both sides by x para mawala yung uh, denominator natin na x. So therefore, pagpalitin lang natin ng pwesto, y is equal to xb raised to 2x, which is equal to xb raised to 2x, letter d. y equals x times b raised to 2x. Okay, so last number for this video, number 130. Which value is equal to logarithm to the base e of e to the negative 7x power? So isulat lang natin yan, logarithm daw to the base e. So logarithm to the base e of e to the negative 7x. e to the negative 7x. Okay? So, apply lang natin yung property ng logarithm. So, kapag meron tayong exponent, di ba yung exponent pumupunta lang dito? Okay, so we have negative 7x logarithm of e base e. And tandaan palagi, ayan, meron tayong same base. Same base and same argument. So, we have negative 7x kapag same ang base at argument equal yun lagi sa 1. So, therefore, magiging sagot na is negative 7x which is letter A. Okay, so another way nga pala para isulat ang, logar ang logarithm ng E or kapag ang base natin ay E equal yun sa LN. Okay, natural logarithm yan kapag ang base natin ay E. Okay, so aragdagang kaalaman lang. So the correct answer negative 7x. So that's all for today. So thank you for watching and kita-kita tayo sa susunod pa nating mga math reviewer para sa engineering mathematics. So good luck po sa lahat ng nagre-review. Bye-bye and God bless.